Hi guys, welcome back to Homemade Food Junkie. Today we are going to teach you how to make a homemade crunch wrap supreme. This is a really popular menu item at Taco Bell, but I prefer to make them at home. They are a little bit healthier and they're easy to make. So let's get started. We are going to begin by dicing up one Roma tomato. Then we're going to add some ground beef into a skillet. I put salt and pepper on it and then just brown it. Next, we are going to add one package of taco seasoning into the ground beef and then just give it a stir until it's thoroughly mixed. We are going to layer everything on a 12 inch tortilla with a six inch tostada shell and then you need a smaller tortilla to fit over the top. Next, we're going to start layering on the ground beef. You want about half a cup and then we are going to spread some nacho cheese sauce. I also spread about a half a cup here and then place the tostada shell on top. We're going to take some sour cream and smooth it all over the tostada shell, put some shredded lettuce on top, and then top it with the Roma tomatoes that we diced earlier, and then I put about a half a cup of shredded Mexican cheese on top. We are going to place the smaller tortilla on top, and then we are going to fold the tortilla into the center, making these little quarter turn folds all the way across, and you want to make sure it's nice and tight. Then we are going to heat up some olive oil on a skillet and we're going to place that crunch wrap supreme seam side down. Cook it for about one minute and then we're going to flip it over and cook it an additional minute to a minute and a half on the opposite side. When it's all done cooking you can go ahead and serve it immediately. I like to serve it with some chips and salsa and a little bit of salad on the side. It makes a delicious little dinner. My husband absolutely loves these. I would serve them right away while they're still warm. That's when they are the best. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you make this recipe, please let me know. I would love to know how it turned out for you. Otherwise, please like and subscribe and we will see you next time at Homemade Food Junkie. Bye-bye.